Fact. Inside the $420 million White House is Joe Biden's new office, famously dubbed the Oval Office. You may have seen his office on the news before, how much do you really know about it? In this video, we'll look at what's inside Joe Biden's new office and what makes it so expensive. Stick around to the end of the video to see the security features that have been brushed under the carpet in the Oval Office, literally. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on more amazing videos. Let's get started. It's amazing story. The first reason why Biden's new office is so expensive is just simply the story behind the Oval Office itself. The Oval Office was created during the expansion of the West Wing in 1909, and its characteristic shape was inspired by the oval-shaped Blue Room in the White House under William Taft's administration. However, it was later relocated from its original location by Roosevelt, who wanted more privacy and sunlight. Since then, the Oval Office went on to become a presidential staple and one of the first places that comes to mind when we think of the White House. But of course, so many years of service also mean that a sizable budget needs to be spent on regular maintenance of the office and redecorating for each president. Let's take a break here for the quiz. The oval rug in the office is usually designed or picked by the new president for the White House's collection. Which president's rug do you think Biden chose for his time in the Oval Office? Is the answer A. George W. Bush, B. Bill Clinton, C. Harry S. Truman, or D. Richard Nixon? Think you know the answer? Take a big guess in the comment section right now and stick around to the end of the video. Find out if you're correct as we reveal the answer. The office decor. The second reason why Biden's new office is so expensive is the high-class decor of the office. The Oval Office is interchangeable with the majesty of the American president, and all new presidents change the decor of the Oval Office to show a glimpse of the kind of presidency they're hoping to have and their personality. Biden switched out many items from Trump's Oval Office. For instance, he picked new paintings, some of the furniture, and a new oval rug to demonstrate a new beginning. It hasn't been disclosed how much Biden used for his decor, but it is public knowledge that Presidents Obama and Trump spent north of one and a half million in their decor the Resolute Desk. Another reason why Biden's new office is so expensive is the iconic desk. The first interior item that significantly contributes to the value of the office is the renowned Resolute Desk. This 1,300-pound desk was gifted to President Rutherford B. Hayes in 1880 by Queen Victoria. The desk was handcrafted from extremely durable oak timbers of a mid-19th century ship deck, and its long history has made the desk historically invaluable. It's been used by many presidents of the United States, so it doesn't really surprise us that Biden has chosen this desk for his office, the artwork. Apart from the desk, there's also plenty of rare artwork which increases the worth of Biden's new office. The paintings are typically selected from the White House's collection or borrowed from museums for the duration of the president's term in office. As such, Biden has opted for a massive portrait of Franklin D. Roosevelt as the main focus of the room. In addition to that, there are paintings of Benjamin Franklin, Thomas Jefferson, Alexander Hamilton, George Washington, and many others. And by the way, this particular George Washington portrait was done in 1823, which makes it a true antique. There are also a few busts of historical figures, such as Cesar Chavez, Rosa Parks, Eleanor Roosevelt, Martin Luther King Jr., and Robert F. Kennedy. Antique items. The fifth reason why the Oval Office is so expensive is the antiques in it. Now, the Resolute Desk and the other paintings are not the only antiques in the office. There's also the Tall Case Clock, famously known as the Oval Office Grandfather Clock. This clock was made between 1795 and 1805 by one of the most famous Boston cabinet makers. John Seymour. It was acquired by the White House in the early 1970s, and it's kept its place as one of the few constant features that stayed in the Oval Offices throughout many presidencies and renovations. In addition to the clock, there's a table behind the Resolute Desk. It was first put in for President Herbert Hoover in 1930, and it's occupied the spot for most of the time since then as a place to put photographs. Security. The sixth reason why Biden's new office is so expensive is that the cost of security in the White House can reach unbelievable amounts. The true degree of protection at the White House has never been released to the public, and rightfully so. But have you ever wondered how the president stays in an office with so many large windows without worrying about his safety? Well, it turns out the windows are bulletproof and practically impenetrable, and installing these windows around the whole building can't be cheap. Besides that, there's also plenty of Secret Service officers and military personnel guarding the office and the whole White House itself who diligently work around the clock to keep the president, the first family, and the staff members safe. As you might already have predicted, the secret security expenses are not small and can grow to about $259 million annually. In addition to agents stationed right outside the Oval Office door, the office itself has been designed to protect the president as well. Some of the most impressive safety features are weight-sensitive pressure pads under the carpet that alert the security staff about the president's whereabouts at all times. And not only that, there are also hidden alarm buttons around the room and even a secret passage hidden outside the Oval Office which allows him to escape in a case of emergency. Now the moment you've been waiting for. The quiz answer. Earlier on, we asked you to guess which president's rug Biden chose for his time in the Oval Office. If you guessed Bill Clinton, 
Give yourself a pat in the back. The dark blue rug that Biden chose for his office was also in the office during the presidency of Clinton, and he chose it because he liked the deep hue of the color. Click on the playlist to the left to binge watch reasons why more presidential stuff, such as The Beast, Air Force One, The White we'll House, and the Resident